Hello, bitches, and I am back for more Pokemon Emerald, randomized Nuzlocke, and I think last time, last time, we just got through the forest, pretty lame, battle some trainers, and we're balling, so that's great. Uh, I also made fun of Fenton, like, a lot, <laughs> and I don't know why, I just had it out for him last time. I don't know what it was, his weird tentacle feet thing, I don't know. He's, he's a really weird thing, but it's fine. I'm not judging him anymore. Still probably going to put him in the box, but <laughs> I'm not judging him anymore. It's fine, guys. It's fine. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, is have Peach and Gerald do this double battle. And hopefully this doesn't, like, suck. And it's like, ho oh, oh and Lugia from these little twin brats. Are they supposed to be? Are they girls, right? A <laughs> couple Nick and Stu. Oh my god. Oh my god. They did not just call these twin sisters a couple. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Why would it do that? That's so wrong. Oh, I hate that. Ah. Oh, no. That's awful. Oh, it hits both of them. Shit. Y'all both get destroyed. Decimated. D E. C I M A T E D decimated. Yes, I spelled that right. I was kind of afraid I was gonna like spell it wrong and look like a complete idiot. Which I mean, I wouldn't put it past me honestly. <laughs> so you know, proud of myself for that one. But look at that, explode, taken down, decimated. Like I said, D E C I A T. -M. Never mind. See, I spelled it wrong. I spelled it wrong. I knew I would do it that time. I, I just went ahead and did it anyways. But my team's actually doing, like, we're doing good. We're doing so good. It's because of Gerald. I love Gerald so much. But I also decided to map the controls to my D-pad on my controller. Because I've been using the joystick, and the joystick is just not, it's not happening. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it. I, ke I always like kept going in the wrong like directions. I was just using it, but I'm like, wait, I mapped it to the D-pad. Why am I still using the joystick? It's so weird, so weird. Also, why does Whale Lord, like, isn't it supposed to be like the biggest Pokemon like ever? And it, like, it, it looks chonky, looks chonky. Don't get me wrong, but like, it just looks small at the same time. Like they didn't, they didn't want to like cover up the entire screen with, Whale Lord's thick butt, so it's like it's just kind of small. Mewtwo. Okay. <laughs> Why does Trainer Rachel have Mewtwo? I don't understand. I guess you make the same argument for like every like red or whatever. Like, why is this little bit? Oh, you ass. <sighs> Fuck you, Rachel. Never liked you, anyways. Ho. Reminds me of Rachel. I love friends. I love friends. Please don't kill me. Wow, not even close. Nice try, bitch. You can't take out Gerald. Gerald is not getting taken out. The day Gerald gets taken out, like I, I think I've said this already. I will, I will cry. Real tears, like actual tears, streaming down my face. Um. Oh. Wow. All my Pokemon are in the yellow. That's not good. Oops. You meant dumbass. Paralyzed. See, I knew that would be handy. Look at that. Look at that. Dumbass. Thank you. That reminds me, Fenton misses all the time. Misses tackle all the time. How do you miss tackle all the time? That's why I felt a little entitled to not like Fenton. <laughs> because, like, just get your shit together. There are so many people in this world who don't have their shit together, and I am tired of it. And Fenton is one of those people. But that's my daily rant. It's over. Runt? Rant? I would go. Words are difficult. I, I'm really glad that Pokemon games have come further than this because that twister looks like some weak ass shit. Like, I'm not gonna lie. What is that? It's like some leaves and a couple pebbles. It's a great move. It's, t it's not gonna have everything, but. Like, what is that? <laughs> like, imagine getting attacked by a couple of leaves and, like, pebbles. And, like, a little dust devil tornado thing. 
Actually, I guess they kind of hurt if I'm up to pebbles while you're hitting you. But still, it might like knock you out. Probably. I don't know. It just seems kind of lame. But, you know, this was like, this game was released in like, what, like 2000. 1985, I don't know, 2004. 2004, I think it's 2004. Uh, I actually was uploading one of the, fir like, the first episode, I think. Uh, the one with, like, the terribly unbalanced audio, which is really sad, but... Oh, well. I'm too far in this now to restart. But, uh, I was, like, t like saying the game. Like, for every YouTube video, like, that's a, a gaming video. Yeah, like, the video game... Like in the description, like shows what video game it is. It has like the published date of like when they came out, and it was 2004, I think. So I shouldn't have like been scrambling my brain so much for when this game was released, as much as I did. But one brain cell currently deteriorating. I have not been in school. I actually had like a, uh, my spring break during this quarantine coronavirus crap uh, last week. But because of this quarantine crap, also, goodbye, Fenton. But, um, yeah. See ya, never. But all this quarantine crap, I've been in my, um, family's house. Uh, and I will be for the whole summer. Which I'm actually, I'm pretty excited about. I was getting real tired of the dorm. The dorm life was, like, was not it. Not it at all. But, you know, he wins some, you lose some. Now, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, I'm, um, I'm gonna catch myself a new team member. My team's looking pretty solid right now. I'm not gonna lie. Um. <laughs> I've never used Delibird, so that's something, I guess. What the hell? <laughs> it was a whole explosion. Oh, okay. I'm gonna play that way. Hmm, I see. I see. Fine, two could play this game. The little stupid hoe. Look at it. Thick thighs. Thick thighs save lives, y'all. What does present even do? Why does it explode? Imagine getting a like a present underneath the Christmas tree. You wake up in the morning, you're so excited, and it just fucking explodes as you open it. That'd be terrifying. Oh! Damn it, we just lost our first one! Why well, couldn't it have been Fenton? I am upset. Ugh. I. God damn it. God damn it, Tellybird, you're not even that good! Why did I sacrifice someone for you? Ugh. At least it wasn't like Gerald or Frederick or something. Uh, and I'm not even gonna catch it. Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> no, I'm so sad. I don't like losing Pokemon. That's so sad. Uh, I hope we don't lose any more. It's gonna suck. This episode would be so sad. I didn't even get to catch this little bitch. God damn it. On the bright side, Big Bertha leveled up. <laughs> no. Fuck you, Deli Bird. God damn it. I am so upset. Well, let's go put it in the PC. Rest in peace, Peach. Maybe it's because the name was like under, like lowercase. No, under? No, lowercase. <laughs> it's lowercase. And Peach's presence just wasn't known. So, guess she had to go. This is so sad. <laughs> no. I'm gonna name it Rip. I guess I should have done this, like, right as the series started, but... <sighs> this is so sad! Our first one down! And hopefully the only one, but I know it's not gonna be the only one. <laughs> it's okay, we have Fenton. <sighs> should I put Fenton back in the team? I don't know. Because I feel like there's gonna be a trainer I get to, and they're gonna, like, decimate me. And I'm gonna have to have someone in here to, like, rely on as backup. So, like, I don't know. But let's name this one back up. Back up. Back that ass up. Yeah, you're in the backup, bitch. Yeah, stay in there. 
fucking Fenton. God damn it! I don't even know if my Pokemon need healing, but I'm just at a loss for words. Uh, well, the rest of this episode is not gonna be super happy because all I can think about is Peach dying from Deli Bird. It wasn't even like cool. It was like Deli Bird throwing an exploding present at you. Like how lame is that? It's fine though. Let's buy some goddamn Pokeballs <laughs> so we can actually catch something next time. I think there's another encounter I can do, or a couple, actually. So, should be fine. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> I didn't even catch it. That is the worst part. I couldn't even catch the little bastard. Sacrificed for nothing. Oh, well. It happens, I guess. But, Route 115, here we are. Let's get... Can we get a new encounter? Oh, no, we can't. Well, damn it. There's still, um... There's still that cave over on the route which we encountered Deli Bird. Ooh, a Luxury Ball. I would not have used that on Deli Bird, by the way. If I came up here and then saw Deli Bird and like and still murdered my my Peach, I would not have used a Luxury Ball. I would use a Luxury Ball on something that's actually worthwhile, not Deli Bird. <laughs> I hate Deli Bird. I used to always hate it. Not really hate, it was just kind of like, why why are you here? <laughs> like, your Deli Bird is just here. <laughs> but now I just hate it even more. It's fine. I don't think Nook has seen action. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stop, 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 stop. Yeah, stop it, you little bitch. No, I don't. Ugh. <laughs> Let me run. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Why? I don't have any antidotes and now I have to go run back to the stupid Pokemon Center and come back here and just waste a bunch of time doing absolutely nothing. Let me run. Okay, I guess I have to switch out. This is ridiculous. What if I lose Nook on the way to the Pokemon Center? I... <laughs> it's not Gerald. It's... At least it's not Gerald. It's okay. Or Frederick. Love Frederick. Frederick is da bomb. Apparently, Deli Bird's presents were also da bomb when they killed my fucking Peach. Still upset about that. Very upset. Oh. Guess who's back on the squad, y'all? It's Fenton. <laughs> I, can't, I can't believe this. Ah! Wow. I wouldn't be as irritated if it wasn't the lamest deaths in existence. battle at all I was trying to run and that was the first time I used Nook and it just died of poisoning it wasn't even in battle Ugh. I knew this shit was gonna happen oh wait I need wow this episode is like eventful but not because I've done abs I've done almost nothing really I've just been a dumbass and losing almost half my team to just stupidity I literally could have had Nook not die but I, ch I just, I was stubborn and just, just refused. <laughs> I am getting five antidotes because I am not letting that happen to anyone else on my team. No way. Let's <laughs> get like two of those, I guess. Potions. Let me, let me, let me cop a few potions too, cause like, this is redonkulous. Redonkulous. I'm so irritated! Ah! 
see that? Such a good Pokemon. Getting coughing. Ah. Got a Firestone <laughs> for if I encounter like a Growlithe or something, that'd be great. Like oh, a Growlithe would be great. I love a Growlithe. Get a good Arcanine in my team. Let's hope Scarlet doesn't annihilate my team. Why is Fenton in the front? I don't know why I put Fenton in the front. I am stupid. Fenton at least has Supersonic, which I actually kind of forgot about. So that's something. Fenton isn't completely useless, but other than that, like what does Fenton have to offer? Exactly. It's okay, Frederick will do the job. I feel like at some point in these, like by next episode, only Frederick and Gerald will be the surviving members of my team <laughs> because I'm just gonna lose everyone to stupid shit. At least I have Gerald and Frederick and it's not all just like Rattata, Pidgey, other crappy Pokemon. Okay, can you stop? I'm, <laughs> I am not risking a critical hit or some bullshit. I am not losing more, any more this episode. Mark my words. I really hope it ended to chinks myself and this will be like a moment I look back, look back on. I'm just like, wow, that happened. Not only did I lose potential amazing Pokemon, I lost Frederick. An absolute pimp. In the best way. That sounded kind of like an insult, that wasn't. I love Frederick so much. As you know, I talk about him and what the hell? How did you miss tackle? <laughs> this game is testing my patience. Maybe I should just stop using tackle. Apparently, tackle is just not the move to use. I don't understand. I really don't understand. Hey, level thirteen. That's some good experience. What else do you have, you little bitch? Parasec. This should be fine. I believe in Big Bertha. Big Bertha's got it. I put so much like experience, I put a lot of training into Peach. Actually, no, I, I took like two minutes to train Peach. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just saying random shit. But, uh, so sad. And yet Fenton is still alive. No. No, you are not using poison powder, you little bitch ass. That's not happening. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Literally, no. Just no. I will have an affinity for poison moves now. Just, I, I can't have it. Not gonna happen. If Gerald dies by poison, then I quit. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. Stop it, yeah, keep missing, keep missing, that's great. You know, just keep being stupid, it'll be great. I'm an expert at being stupid, so I would know how to tell you how to be stupid. I'll gladly give you advice, Parasect, if that's what you want, but you seem to be doing it fine on your own, so, you know, keep on being stupid. Stop, don't be paralyzed. At least you're not poisoned, but like, come on, Gerald, get it together, you're not dying by Parasect, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I mean, critical hit's great, but I could've used it on the first time you attacked this stupid thing. Ugh. You know, this game has not gone hard at all, and I'm already struggling, so I feel like by the time I get to, like, the third gym leader or something around there, it's gonna just, like, annihilate me. Completely just destroy me. But you know what? I'm just gonna... Okay, I guess I'm battling a wild Pokemon. I could have had that. God damn it. I could have had all these great things. Like Laron. And okay, well I guess it's the only good one I saw. I could have had Laron though. Instead I got Deli Bird. And it fucked me. It's okay. Operator Donna's here. Donna's a popular name in this uh, randomizer. That's interesting. That's really weird actually <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna name my next Pokemon Donna it's gonna happen no matter the gender hopefully I remember that you know what actually I'm gonna write in my notes because I know I'm definitely going to forget that oh my college just texted me that 
I, I have classes starting next Monday. And that makes me super sad. Because I don't want to do classes. I am... I just... I, I'm so over classes. Like, you graduate high school and you're kind of just like... Is college really worth it? And you're like, okay, I guess. So... Oh, you said for some people. So... You go. And you're still like, is it really worth it? <laughs> because classes are so... Uh, like, your major classes are great. For, for the most part. But... Just all the like core classes, like I'm taking English 1102, and I'll be done with English as long as I pass this semester. Um, after this semester, but like it's just I'm not, I don't wanna, I don't wanna take English. Like please, I just I'm so done. I'm so done with English, and I have to take a math class at some point, And oh my god, ah, bitch, don't talk to me about math. I'm not here for her. Math is just. She backstabbed you. You think you understand it. You think you understand her, and she just whap. Just nope. Uh-uh. You don't understand her. You don't understand her at all. And that's when she backstabs you. Is when you don't understand her. And it's like math. I thought we had something special. And apparently you didn't. And she's like, bitch, you thought. So yeah, that's why I hate math. I don't know why I explained it like that, but there you go. That's why I hate math. Anyways, that shall be the end of this episode. I know I'm, I'm kind of ending in like weird places, like the middle of routes, but I'm going to train for like a hot second. And then at some point, I will record the next episode and hopefully things will be better. And I won't lose Pokemon to poisoning and Delibird's exploding presence. Because that'd be great. So, with that, uh, I'll see y'all next time. And it's been great. Bye!